Hello everyone, this is Raviel334, and I've actually gotten a comment on the Fire Emblem Path of Radiance cheated playthrough for someone asking how to access the cheats on the Dolphin emulator. Now, myself, I've looked it up previously on how to access cheats, so first what you want to do is check your configuration. In the settings section, you should be able to see the Enable Cheats box. If you've already got um, Dolphin downloaded, you just want to tick that box and make sure it is always checkmarked. And once you're done with that, it can be closed. Doesn't matter. Nothing else up here then matters. You can hit config, but that's going to take you straight to the same thing. So the next thing you want to do, so is find the game you want to cheat. So the user, uh, which thank you, uh, Melfagor, for actually asking this. Asked how to do this. So, after you've figured out which game you want to cheat, you go to Properties. Click that. You should see now that cheat codes are enabled a section two sections called gecko codes and AR codes. The section I use personally, or at least I used on that, was the AR code section, as can be shown by this. There's all kinds of codes uh, that already come pre-gen, and to show that they come pre-gen, let me find a game I haven't tried cheating yet. Uh, I think I haven't tried Ocarina of Time one. See? haven't touched it yet, but the Ocarina of Time Master Quest has all these cheats pre-gen the minute you put the codes into, the minute you put the uh, game into the Dolphin Emulator's folder for where you want it to hold. Jedi Knight, no codes. So that means more than likely if there are codes, I would have to add them myself. Metabots, none. Custom Robo, none. Chibi Robo, however, which I do have a series on this for running it, I do not use any of these. Because to me, infinite battery energy before getting the Giga Robo upgrade is a bit cheating. Max money is a bit cheating, and so is max happy points. That's completely cheating. And max happy points would just get us to Super Chibi Robo immediately. So uh, when the first episode came out, there was another save file that had, like, a lot of money on it. That's actually the one that I started cheating on, and I never got back to. Uh, Magical Melody. They might not all... C nope, right here. I've never touched Collector's Edition on this. But, lo and behold, cheat codes, boss keys, and compass map. Wow, Ocarina of Time's got a lot of stuff. Nice. Jor's Mask, event items. Hmm. And Wind Waker demo. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. <laughs> I started, uh... So you can also clone and edit the codes while you're doing this. But, uh, as you can see, the remove code one is actually not, uh, being allowed. So, going back to, uh, Harvest Moon, you can see remove code is perfectly there. So, any codes that are already popped in via this, I don't think you can, re yeah, you can't remove them. But, um, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, ring the notification bell. See more videos from me, and as always, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.